The overall goal of this procedure is to perform a rapid analysis of volatile compounds in fruits. This is accomplished by first cutting and homogenizing the fruit tissue. The vapor phase above the liquid sample is then analyzed with the electronic nose. Following electronic nose analysis, the data is exported and transformed. The final step of the procedure is to identify COVATS index windows and consolidate the peaks under a single COVATS index label using the graphical interface. Ultimately, the results show that differences in abundance of fruit volatiles, as measured with an electronic nose, can be related to experimental treatments such as fruit variety, maturity, and storage. The main advantage of this technique over existing methods such as traditional gas chromatography is that it allows a more rapid analysis of volatile compounds in fruit. When performing this analysis, slight changes in analyte retention times may occur. This could lead to misinterpretation of the data without careful consideration of the peak alignment process. After harvesting fruits at the desired maturity stage, rinse with tap water in order to remove dirt and dust. Select fruits for analysis based on the absence of external and internal defects and size homogeneity. Cut fruits longitudinally into wedges to be used for volatile sampling. If applicable, remove skin, seeds, seed cavity tissue, or pit. Fruit tissue selection must be consistent throughout the experiment and variability within a single fruit should be taken into account. For example, samples should be obtained equally from the equatorial, blossom, and stem...